So just a quick recap. Kenny is going to be very expensive. We are looking at a bronze rare, silver rare, an 83 squad, an 85 team of the week Liverpool, an 86 team of the week Prem, an 87 team of the week, an 87, 87, 88, 88, 89, 88, 89. And I've already pre-recorded this, so go ahead and watch that now. So if you want to grind Kenny Dalglish, what I recommend doing is all of these SPCs you see on the screen. Now, I've already done a video on how to grind all of these. It will be in the comment section down below, so I'm not going to break into that. But what I will do is show you a little something that I'm working on. I've got 13 out of 20 done for Mbappe. Don't know why he's broken. And he is going to be going into a separate video. So if you want to see that, subscribe to the channel. And let's just begin this grind. So the premium mixed league upgrade and the mixed league upgrade are going to be your best friend for this. And also, on top of that, we do get ourselves an 80 plus flash upgrade that comes out every hour make sure you're doing them because they're going to give you extra bonuses in terms of getting it done so starting off with the premium mix we're going to go ahead and complete the last two that are the most difficult starting off with Liga and Eredivisie so the three teams I use is Nice which is the one on the screen now Ajax from Eredivisie and PSV from Eredivisie now every single card is around 750 to 800 max you can get them all cheaper if you're packing them it makes the cost down even lower now, don't forget, every time we get a brand new pack in the store, there's going to be a lightning round. It means people are going to list up cards even cheaper so you can snipe them quicker. Now, with this pack, it is tradable and we are looking to sell and discard everything from this pack. Even if it's a special card, a team of the week, an Mbappe, whatever, you are going to go ahead and sell and discard everything of value. So we are going to go ahead and sell all of these cards on here, discard all these contracts and much more. So we're going to go ahead and do that now and I'll be right back. So they have been all sold and now we're going to discard everything else. Now the reason why you want to do that is because you're going to get your coins back or at least lose a little amount of coins every time you do it. Now moving over to the Libertadores and Sudamericana. So how I like to do it is I add in a couple concepts and whatever I have and then I'll go ahead and put in the rest of the players. So let's say we've got 64 rated. I should be able to go ahead and buy these cards. Now the reason why you put them in concept is because they're going to come up much quicker. And you can see here because of lightning rounds and everything else, the Libertadores have dropped down in price making it cheaper. Now Cavani is really important because he's high rated. There is also Fernandez who plays for uh, another team that's also like 78 rated. He's also important. But you can see here you can get them for around 1500 each. Now if I wanted to do this not in the video I would keep going until I get them to about 1200 each maybe a little bit less there are some cards that are going to be considerably cheaper than others and more that are going to be a little bit more but you want to go through and add them all in concept until you find prices around 1500 max now once you've got all the goals and you've got the rating or you think you've got the rating what you want to go ahead and do then is when I get this card for around 1500 1600 see here 1600 I'd keep sniping until I got them cheaper but for the video I won't bother now what you want to do is go back to this go all the way down to either Sudamericana or Libertadores and just set this to 200 and look to buy any card that's around, for example, 73 rated. It's gone, unfortunately. But you're looking for any silvers that are high rated to go in. Like I say, make sure they're not from the same team. And then you want to get any golds or bronzes, sorry, I meant to say bronzes, that are around 63 rated and around that rating. The reason being is you're going to get closer and closer to 74. So we're on 70. So as long as I get another two 63s, we should be around, or 62s. We should be around the rating. There was a 67 right there on the screen, which is frustrating. So I've only got one more to buy. Hopefully we can get ourselves a silver or someone high rated. 63 there. Next page. 64. Perfect. So that's going to get us done. So you can see here we spent 200 on all of those. And we haven't got the rating. Now the reason why we haven't is because I need someone who's higher rated than 62. So I'm going to go ahead and get that. But we can save him for another SPC. So it's not exactly ruined in that sense. So let me go ahead and get this card quickly. So we did actually need one more gold. And in the end we've kept these cards. Now these cards can be used for another SBC and I'll show you what it is. But now we've got ourselves two packs untradeable. Now these can be very, very valuable even if they are untradeable. And let me explain while we head over to the store. Because the first one is an 80 plus, it's going to be golds and silvers. Every single thing in this card, no matter if it's a walkout or not, 87 is going to be fantastic for Adele Gleish and Mbappe and 83 times 10, whatever you want to do. But also that, of course. And then we've got a Premier League, Premier League, Serie A. Bundesliga can go all back into the league SBC. Silver upgrade can go into the Dalglish Silver Rare or any other icon or into a silver upgrade. Championship League SBC. League on we don't need for this. So again, it can go into Dalglish or another League SBC, etc. Or grow upgrade, sorry. Two Sudamericanas can go back into the SBC. I'm going to show you in a minute. And then we've got ourselves an 81 duplicate, which we could either keep hold of, which we're going to have to send up. 
and then we can go put back into Syria or into an 81 double upgrade because he's a rare. And then you get this 82 plus overall pack. Now, this is where you're going to get hopefully most of your fodder from that's high rated. But because it's a video, we're going to get ourselves an 84 small in. But again, everything in this pack can be used round. So, for example, 84 into Del Gleish or any of the upgrades that are out. Same for the 83. Bundesliga, Bundesliga, La Liga, La Liga can go into the league SBCs. The French player, the other French league un player here, can go into any of the upgrades we want to do. For example, the flash ones. Bundesliga, Bundesliga into the league SBC. And our two duplicates here that are rare can go into the Serie A and into the Premier League, which I'm going to go ahead and do now. So back into the premium mix, we have got a Serie A and Bundesliga and a Premier League and La Liga. So I'm going to go ahead and complete them now. So now that we well and truly have the chemistry, there's two things I can do. Carry on with Premier League, or I'm going to go to La Liga and pick the highest rated cards to get the rating. Now, the reason why I like doing this is because then you do not get any duplicates or any other clubs that could be the same that will stop you from doing it. And you've got yourself basically a whole new league to go through. So what I'm doing now is just adding loads of players to the bench to be able to continue this on. So that has been done. So if our Ollie Watkins was untradeable duplicate, we would have got him back round again. This gives us a guaranteed 82 plus six rare gold players. And now we have to go do the same with the Serie A because we have a Danilo who's a duplicate. And again, now Danilo has been recycled. We get ourselves a tradable pack back from this and we can go ahead and sell everything in this pack to get some of the coins back that we may have spent on the Libertadores of Sudamericana. So first of all, let's go send Danilo back into our club. Let's open up this tradable team of the well, tradable pack, sorry, I don't want to say team of the week. And we're going to sell everything in this again. It's like just a gold rare English. It's going to be right back. Hopefully it's Trent. We'll have to see when we skip this. And it isn't, unfortunately, it's going to be a one per sack. So again, we're going to go ahead and sell every single one of these cards. Now that they've all been sold, let's open up our tradable pack that we got from doing the Premier League and La Liga. And the same thing with this. Make sure you're doing this with every single pack. Every single thing has some sort of value. So, for example, there's 83 into any upgrade we want. La Liga and Premier League can go back into the same SBC. We saved them. This can go into an 81 double, the same as her. And we have got this card here for the Libertadores and Sudamericana. So you can see there, it kind of goes round and round and round itself. Now, if you don't have anything from scratch, you're going to have to check out the bronze pack method in the video down below. And just to show you my transfer list, to show you what I have been selling and the coins we have been getting back while going through this process, you can see here that all of these cards are selling. Definitely check before, just make sure you're selling them for the right price. If you have any questions, comment down below. And that's how you're going to be able to grind these SBCs that have come out.